Well, today's announcement also comes with big news for high school and youth sports because starting next Thursday, March 18th, the capacity for spectators and outdoor sports will expand to 25%. Crem 2's Amanda Rowley joins us live from uh, Cheney High School football game with reaction from parents tonight. Amanda. Good evening, Tom. That's right. We're hearing a lot of excitement from parents and their student athletes about this news today. In fact, we're already seeing some changes starting today. The Greater Spokane League is allowing two spectators for all freshman and JV sports, and that's something we are seeing here today at the Cheney High School freshman football game. Parents are already making their way to the stands, and this does fall into that restriction for phase two with the maximum of 200 people. Now, just yesterday, I talked to a parent who was imploring the state and GSL to let them in the stands just to watch their athletes play. Now, starting next Thursday, they will no longer have to cheer on the varsity teams, any of those teams from the fence line. I am so ready for our sports to be open and to be able to come and see them and bring grandma and grandpas and all of that stuff. It's, we're just so ready to have something similar to what it used to be before the whole pandemic shut us all down and watch sports and cheer on the boys. Now, to be clear, the reason GSL is allowing some spectators in the stands for freshmen and JV sports is because these games typically have less people on the field compared to varsity sports. GSL says it wants to maximize the current limit of 200 people. Still seeing some parents filling in today and a lot of them really cheering at the news that, hey, we're moving to phase three here in a few days. Reporting from Cheney, Amanda Rowley, Crem 2 News.